Hello guys, this is T-Stu. Welcome to another week. Woo! And so this is our maze tutorial for those who haven't seen our maze tutorial before. This is what we did last week. We built a maze about kind of invisible walls. So you see I can't really get everywhere without doing some good hard work. And I can't get through there. Oh boy. So we got through. Yay! So invisible walls are a very crucial point in kind of a complicated maze. We have we went through an example of a maze that I built um, a while ago that is an invisible wall maze. And I won't go through that again with you guys this week, but I will go through our new one. In case you guys are wondering, I am building the Disney castle and I just finished my version of the Disney Jungle Cruise. There'll be a video of my tour of the Jungle Cruise coming up very soon. As well as that video, we have a, a new quick build that'll be up on Monday. So we're gonna go through our little maze that we have built and then kind of explain how it works. So you walk into my maze and you're thinking, oh, pretty simple, it's just an open room. Oh, hey, look, a hallway. Oh, I can't get through. Now, I made it very simple to find the switch. Normally, you're gonna try to hide that switch a little bit better. And then also, I made it very more or less simple to, to find the, the place to put it. Now, we can do this a number of ways, and I'll go over those in future videos possibly with you guys on how to hide that properly. But I'm gonna go over with you guys now how to make this work. So we're gonna head outside. Oop, looks like I destroyed that. We'll have to fix that when we go in there and look there. Okay, so we're gonna go outside, kind of show you guys what is the deal with this. So first I'm just gonna teach you a very, very basic redstone principle that is important for this type of build. What you need is to, to, to build an inverter. Now, an inverter basically just acts as a, um, a way to flip the this um, redstone signal. So you see right here, it is going, um, it's absolutely out right here, it's running. So if we flip the switch, this turns on, that turns off. So this is an inverter. Now, the thing is, with the inverter, we're gonna be able to do something very important. We're gonna be able to make it so that this switch doesn't have to be on here to have the redstone going, and then we can turn it off. When we're building that section, we're gonna need to do that. So I, all I'm doing is I'm gonna place the redstone to turn my creation on. And to do that, we just do a little square. We have everything running, perfect. And there we go. Actually, all we need to do is that right there, and that's perfect. Sorry guys, I'm, I'm still learning redstone myself too bits and pieces of it. So I won't always have the perfect solutions for you, but I will have some pretty good solutions for you guys. So all we have to do now is kind of take a look at putting this here. It's going to invert the signal and turn it off. So what we're going to do now is we're going to come into my control room, as we call it. So since I know that we don't need all that fancy stuff right there, all I'm going to do is put the redstone torch there. Now it's running. And you can't get through. So that's how we do this build, just in case you guys are wondering. And the beauty of it is you can do a lot of different things with this build, this type of strategy and this type of wall. So it's a false wall. You guys don't, I mean, you can build it to the point where it's coming, oops, sorry. I'm just a little bit up on the thing. You can build it to the point where right here is where that's gonna be coming through. So it's just a square room. So you have no idea what wall you need to go through. You have no idea what spot you need to go through. Um, you just know that there's gonna be a spot somewhere in this that I need to get through. And the fun thing about this is you can make an open room, make a room right here. And, and one of the things I did on an early on maze that I built is I made a kill room. So next episode, we're gonna be talking about kill rooms and and kind of the, the purpose of it. So that way we have a fight to get this lever. But we're gonna keep it simple, guys, and end that here today. Hope you guys have a great one, and I will see you guys next time on Tim's Maze Tutorials. Bye!